Hey guys, it's Dom from 210 Culture. We're here today with Culture Creations and we're on episode 15 and what's a sweeter treat than trying street treats here at Judson Plaza by Judson High School. Yeah, we're definitely gonna see what this new social street treat vendor has to offer San Antonio as well as everybody that goes to high school around here or school. They have the unicorn elote, and they also got the unicorn ice cream, and they also have a lot of flavored treats here. So let's go ahead and see, try it out. You know, this is a rare animal, and we just found a rare treat as well. So let's go ahead and see what's good. All right. So now that we've gotten our unique items here from the street treats, let's see what the street brought us. So here we got our hot Cheeto and pick, fried, fried pickles. Our uh, pickles that are fried hot Cheeto batter. As you can see here, beautiful, beautiful. I love hot Cheetos and pickles. This brings my two loves together. And then of course you got the ranch. You can't, you can't have it without ranch, but let's try it without it. Wow definitely want to have it more hot cheeto battered items like man i would totally eat this on fried chicken whatever but on a pickle great now we got our unicorn ilota as you can see this, this is beautiful enough to be on a stallion as a horn but you know it's basically it's cheese. This is just a little bit of food coloring, but it looks magical, doesn't it? Man, and then you got the little lime here, go across. Perfect commodity. Of course, you know, we're gonna go ahead and give that a try in a little bit. But then we're gonna wash it all down with a pina colada. No, it doesn't have liquor in it, but trust me, you could use it with this heat. Man, look at this. It's so shaved ice, and of course it has some food coloring. And it also has some pineapple chunks in there. Feels like I'm at the bar already. Like oh, all the time. Especially with pina coladas on the brain. Man. The taste, the flavors of summers are coming through. And it's looking delightful. So we should definitely give Street Treats a try because they got these unique ideas and they're at a very affordable price. You should definitely check it out. With their, check it out. They always have new things coming out over here by Judson High School in the Judson Plaza. Tell them that 210 Culture sent you. Other than the unique items you see here, they also have some local famous dishes such as the brisket Frito pie, brisket fries, and they also got brisket tots, as well as hot Cheeto tots. And they also got mango nadas, mango nada bears, which is very unique because there are big old gummy bears on a mango nada. So it's something great for the kids, the family to try out. I mean, they also got ice creams that are other than this, like the Cookie Monster ice cream they have that, you know, it'll really bring the child out on you. The uni unicorn ice cream, uh, milkshakes of wide varieties, and also, you know, anything that you would think candy, surfer, um, a surfer's delight, which is a very huge sundae with like gummy bears and everything in it. Really great. Something you have to see this summer and refresh and get out of the sun. Well, after those magically delicious treats that Street Treats provided us, I really would like to come here to cool down this summer to try out their many offerings and maybe you can too because street treats are gonna go mobile so they might be in a street near you or a location near you because they will have a food truck that is going to be given that are going to be selling their special treats from the street so now you can also follow them on facebook and instagram and Definitely can give you some insight on that and let you know about new items that might be coming out soon. So, you know, this summer you definitely want to give Street Treats a try because you know the street knows what's good. So this is Dominic from 210 Culture 
And remember, 210 Culture, bringing the best of 210 Nation.